How's it going guys? It's me Ducky. Welcome back to the Wolf Among Us. I think we just entered the hotel, so well, I don't even know what to do. The Open Arms Hotel, the Bronx, late evening. Haha, <laughs> half and half cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, it's all everything so ironic. Want it by the hour or for the whole night? Oh, oh, uh, oh. I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. So now you know. I know I should have told somebody, but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beauty, I could honestly not care less about this. Do what you want. All right, jeez. Oh. I thought since you didn't tell Beast you saw me, you cared how I felt. But I guess not. I'm so bad. So, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie, Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh, oh, yes, the, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. Uh, did you know Faith? Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's, it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, <laughs> Heather... Sorry. Don't trust names. Ever see Lily with someone here? <coughs> Maybe on a job? Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Smith? <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last ones are jokes. Oh, that's not very nice to anyone actually called Johnson. I talked to Tweedledee earlier today. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him or his brother? I took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? It was from the crooked man. Beauty. You don't know how desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look. If this ever happens again, come see me or Snow first, all right? I tried. Bad baby. I, uh, have you, have seen, you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't I say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't snow and went about my business. Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. <laughs> It's getting tense, but it's not really. But at least we solved that mystery out about uh, Beauty. I, I thought like she was in some sort of cult that committed necrophilia, but apparently not. Apparently not. Listen, Bigby, I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something, which is fine. It's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see you report. It's just... Don't worry about it. The less I have to write down, the better. Thanks. I appreciate it. Well, here we are. Which one was it? <laughs> I 
Okay. <laughs> yeah, not that rude. But let's just go into the, this room and see what was actually in here. And go back to 207 Latest. Never sure why they have desks in a place like this. <laughs> All right. Do you get health inspectors through here very often? I don't know. What do you think? Finding what you're looking for? I wasn't expecting much in here. But isn't this why you're here? Why you have the key? No. The key was just to be sure I found the right hotel. This isn't the room Lily was using. Oh. So, are we done now? No. The room they met in was 207. Yeah, let's go this way. <laughs> I really want to open. <laughs> no, I'm not going to let them have their fun. Is that weird? I don't think that's weird. Let's high five the door. Alright, let's open the door. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. You have to let me in there. This is the room, 207. But I... This is the room Lily was in. Oh, <sighs> fine. She doesn't seem happy. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, oh, shit. Beast? Big B? How could you oh, do this to me? So no, sweetie, no! Wait a minute! How could you do this? We've been together through everything! I took care of you! I love- It's not what you think! Please! You're cheating on me! So With him?! No, no, Beast! I promise I'm not! I'm helping him, that's all! I'll bet! I'm sure you help each other just great! I know what this place is! This is a murder investigation. She's helping me- Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, listen to me! There's nothing going on! I'm not- <laughs> Hey! Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! I knew you were sneaking around! Listen to your wife. Just calm down and- Beast! Oh, now he's got more That's ah! ah! What the hell do you think you're doing? You aren't even listening to me! She's my wife, Bigby! I told you! Don't want to see this. Oh. Uh, 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 
I've got the door open. Oh my god. Don't touch anything. Is this... is this... Lily met her client here. Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then? Must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work at the front desk. I... so that's... Did you notice anything out of the ordinary? There might have been some loud noises. I, I, I don't know. I mean, loud noises aren't out of the ordinary. I didn't hear anyone <laughs> screaming or anything like that, but shouldn't I have? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But Just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? <laughs> His face, though. How can he go... His face like that? Big B, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. Uh, blue beard. I can't I, I believe this. Do all the rooms have these same yeah, clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Mm, that's one hell of a sexy cassette Looks there. like she was lying down when she was killed. Flowers were already here. How do you know that? Blood pattern. Also, I'd say the body was dragged off the foot of the bed. There. The body. Jesus. You could say she. Poor girl. I just can't even imagine. This is actually pretty horrific. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. Oh, cool. The whole book is about her? I can't read. Yeah. Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Hmm. What's it mean? Why mark the page where she's sleeping? Oh. I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers, too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to kiss her. That's our Mr. Smith. This is creepy. The coffin and, and a weird fixation on snow. What the hell is wrong with this guy? Okay, I think we're done with that. Um, ashtrays. It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. He brought wine. Classy. <laughs> God. Right, what's this? Oh, cassette. My rival. Alright, let's play that. Bigby, this? I think I heard this music. Last night, it was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. Poor girl. Oh god, that's so cute. Do you smell something? No, just apple. Huh. What? What are you thinking? Oh, Snow White and the Apple. Murder makes me hungry. <laughs> it's got a single bite here, taken out of it, like in Snow's story. Oh no, do you <coughs> think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. 
It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course. That makes perfect sense. It fits. He's acting out scenes from the book. That poor girl. This is so, so bad. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person... Georgie took advantage of her when she was in trouble. He's a real predator. Yeah. She must have been so scared. Okay, so... Sorry about that, but the thing just glitched like a bitch. Okay, I guess. This is so disturbing. I mean, this music. Someone's been <coughs> rough with this dress. It's torn. So weird. Oh no. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and then and then he took it back off? No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. <laughs> oh no, there's more? What? What now? He could be across town. This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. It's another match to what's in the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in a snow white dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. So he planned it all out. He had all the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any this longer. This is way too kinky. It's ridiculous. Oh, man. Oh, more evidence. Okay. of the dead girl? Not all of her. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Big B. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand-in for Snow is gone now, so... The next step closer. No, it's him. What is it? <gasps> She's a homosexual. Rain. Oh my god! No way! No way! No fucking... No. No! Magic mirror! What the fuck? I don't even know. I don't even know. Oh, it's going... Oh my god, this is ridiculous. I don't even know what's happening. How? How is it him? I don't think it was him that murders it. What? No, it was he didn't murder her. I'm putting I'm yeah. He didn't murder her. They wouldn't have just revealed that in episode two and there'll be another three episodes. He could be after you now. Oh. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. That's so wrong. That old guy. Oh. Oh. oh, he's getting back for himself. Oh, that's so fucked up, man. So now Crane knows. He's dying to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. <laughs> I quite like you. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. Well, why did they make Lee such a dickhead? I mean, he's so nice. Hello, Big B. Are we all done? 
Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. Oh, but I was so nice to her. Why does she have to be such a bitch to me now? Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? Oh my god, okay. That's one. Th oh. What if it's Big B that's killing them all? Plot twist. No. But how do you respond to creating about 63 percent? I feel like such an idiot now. Actually, I don't know. He did seem genuinely sad. That's why I don't think it was him that killed her. How do you treat the murder suspects? Persuade him to talk. I was nice to him. I was good to him. I um, I was good. It's no, yeah, that's an obvious one. I mean, she's already pissed at you. Don't want to make her even more pissed. All right, we didn't hit Georgie. I wanted to so badly. Did you keep punching Beast when he was down? No. I think, yeah, that was the right call. I mean, he was so confused. He's, he's nice, but he's, he's a fucking idiot. Oh my god, I really want the next bit to come out now. But, I think what they're doing now is bringing one month a Walking Dead episode and one month a Wolf Among Us episode. So, that'll be really awesome. Which reminds me. The, one of the next series I'll be doing will be The Walking Dead and I'll start from Season 1 and I'll do the DLC and then we go on to Season 2 hopefully in time for the actual release of Season 2 which will be, or well, Episode 2 which will be pretty good so God, this is, this game though it's such a mind fuck so many plot twists, it's ridiculous but anyway, I'm Absolutely loving this, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Tune in next time for more. Fuck you out.